up, Cliff? Spectacular performance at Akusaka, you two. Simply impressive. Thanks. Your gadgets and hints were helpful. Yeah. What have you got for us next? I'm still in the midst of preparing, but there's been quite a commotion in the alley nearby. Perhaps you could go see what the fuss is about while I finalize these. I'll be done soon. No rush, Cliff. Yeah, take your time. We'll go see what the hoo-ha is about. Mayday and Zook, I've been waiting. Ooh, for what? Oh, where are my manners? I'm Zam. I heard about your gig with the DJ and saw what you did at Akuzuka. I gotta say, I'm thrilled to see your efforts to make a change. Simply inspirational. Thanks, Zam. Why don't you join us in the Stand Against NSR? Interesting that you should say so. I'm currently starting my brand new radio channel for the occasion. Oh, that's cool. How are preparations going? It was going fine until the place was reclaimed just the other day. It'll take some time for me to recover my equipment and set up a new broadcasting booth. You need a place? Why don't you come over to our pad? We happen to have some extra space. Can I? Really? What do you say, Zook? Sure thing. The more the merrier. Awesome! I'll get Sam and Fam up in a jiffy and have you guys on it soon! Bro. Oh, brother. Eh, eh, the other away, Baru, bro. So fast. Brother, ramai po buy copy kas karang la, huh? <laughs> Missy, nama ku DK West. Ewa, read my bayang super guy. Ewa, dulu dan kini hebat selama niya. Ewa, dan satu lagi, 
Aku pun sebenarnya Zook punya. Oh, brother. Exactly. Zook's big brother. Salam perkenalan. Awak ni mesti Mede. Oh. So this is your brother? How come you don't share his accent? Well, I don't know. How come your hair is yellow? What's that got to do with West? What are you doing here? Oh, tak ada apa. Cuma kongsi aja dengan orang kat sini apa erti music sebenar. <laughs> Real music? Ah. Kau betul nak buat hal kat sini? Sekarang? Hui, kau selalu macam tu. Angry only. Aku lupa birthday kau. You angry. Tak jawab message kau. You angry. Aku jual drum set kau. You angry. Eh, hey, jangan macam tu lah. Stop it, West. You're disrupting our music revolution, man. We've got tons of things to do, and I don't have time to play around with you. You understand? Hey, relax, bro. Relax. Kalau kau nak fans kau balik, senang je. Tunjuk kat mereka siapa lebih hebat. Hadap aku di... Eh, 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 Rap battle! I said I don't have time to play. Okay lah, aku pergi cuy lagi fans kau. Ah, fine then. Let's get this over with. Jaya <laughs> When you see Zook in school, he was constantly out of fuel. All he does is follow me. Like a stinking fly, he can't help it cuz... I'm the trailblazing guy. Zook knows nothing like a baby. Everywhere he looks, he thinks maybe. I have to show him the ropes, but all he does is move. See West in school, he ain't nothing but a ridicule. He thinks he's a top student, but when in truth, he's nothing but imprudent. Feels like he's entitled to everything. Tells the birds for him they should sing. Chest up, walks around proud, with a small push and he was sure drop loud. <laughs> Lookie there, little boy Zuki. Little boy right there. Oh, he's such a rookie. Well, at least I had my friends. You only had me pretend all the way to the end. You're lucky we're even related. Because you're my brother. If not, stop and be bothered. And because I'm the world's greatest, you can pause, go all in my shadows, bask in the awesomeness, the magnificence, the one and only DK West. Think you're the center of everything, but this greatness that you speak simply hides the fact that you're meek. And these delusions are really your illusions, and your rhymes are just behind the times. You think that you are a king, but if I said that, I'd be lying. The world doesn't revolve around you, even in the multiverse, you're not worth a verse. Oh, rest, 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 rest in peace. Oh, he's dust. <laughs> Zook in college, he still thirsts for my knowledge. Only knows how to trim me by, or else I do high. He does nothing but cry. He thinks he's a real ace when he's a real bad case. All he does is copy my moves and make me smash tempos that don't go. College is such a shame. The top spot is no longer his to claim. All respect he used to have has now been dropped, dropped, dropped in half. He hates seeing me succeed so well. He turns into a child and bids college bye bye. The once great West, with all his charming ability, has now learned a hard lesson in humility. <laughs> Zook's 
a real betty robber, not even a showstopper. He stole all my friends, had none, none, none of his own. And Nadia, man, you remember that girl? You only added her because I was in the sheet. You couldn't stop at stealing friends. You stole a girl that made me couldn't breathe. Robber of friends, copycat Zook. You ain't nothing without West. You ain't nothing without West. You ain't nothing without West. you, Wes, because you were slimy, sleazy, cheesy. Ewa, going on hero. Actually, see Desperado. From a scale of one to ten, you are below the bottom of the lame, lame end. You are never as good as you thought. Oh, your imagination never had a drought. You think you're a marathon runner. You never even ran right on pilot. You were canceled. The end. As you left college with the most shame to hide. Left the loser, snoozer, my brother. Oh, my drop. Reality check, please. Cash that adopting life. You D K hack. Hey, 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 Kau pergi rehat dulu. Ha? Aku datang balik bila kau boleh rap macam pro. Okay, bro. West out. Hey, where are you going? I want this battle fair and square. You hear me? Hey! Hey! Right. Okay, leave. Just leave. Okay. I'm sensing a lot of anger here. What happened to Zook, the chillest music man in Vinyl City? <sighs> Yeah, I know, I know. Just that the sky is so, so. Ah! Ewa! And welcome to Zamp FM. Good afternoon, folks of Vinyl City. You're now tuned into a very special segment here on Zamp FM. I have some rare guests with me today. Let's have them introduce themselves. Hello, peeps. I'm Bumpet Junction's Mady. And this is the other half of Bumpet Junction, uh, Zook. Welcome, Mayday and Zook. Thanks for having us. The pleasure's mine, Zook. Now, a lot of our listeners know of Bunk Bed Junction, but they want to know more. I hope that through these sessions, you guys can tell us more about yourselves, your band, and everything else in between. So, without further ado, I'll go ahead with my first question. How did the band's name come about? First of all, it's because Bunk Beds rock. We have one. With me taking the top bunk, of course. Okay, but what about the junction bit? Didn't you say on TV that you wanted to build a junction into NSR's highway so that more people can join the party? Doesn't that contradict the whole part about you fighting NSR? Glad you asked. 
Today, we are unveiling Bangpit Junction's new meaning. We want to build a junction that goes away from NSR's highway. Because they don't deserve any fans. They blow. Oh, does this tie into what you want to do with your music in Vinyl City? We believe that music belongs to everyone and not just NSR. We're going to fight for the people, for music, for artists like us. An ambition that is highly looked upon by many, Mayday and Zook. Do you feel pressured with a sudden wave of attention? Your fan base has been growing rapidly as of late. Well, a little, but it's the good kind of pressure. One that will motivate us to carry our agenda to the very end. Someone has to stand up for musical freedom here in Final City. Couldn't have said it better myself. Time's almost up. Don't want to be chipping more of your busy schedule. Thank you for being here today, Bunk Bed Junction. You're welcome. So, did you guys manage to deal with the alley problem? Yup. Turns out, it was Zook's big brother this whole time. <laughs> well, that doesn't sound too bad. Oh, it's bad, all right. Mm, excuse me? Nothing. Um, let's just get on with the next mission, shall we? Right. To business. Uh, today, we'll be dealing with something quite unique. Are you guys ready for the classics? Will my master's degree be helpful for this? <laughs> you bet. Head towards the nature of district. I've prepared some tickets for you. Tickets? What are we watching? The question is, who? A performance by Vinyl City's greatest pianist, Yinu. Truly a child prodigy. Child? We'll be going against a kid? Um, that sounds... Don't underestimate her just because of her age. I would advise you to approach Yinu with extra caution. Despite NSR's bias, it's no simple feat to be where she is at her age. Got it. Well, I'm not one to refuse a gig invitation. Let's go, Zook! And thanks for the tickets, Cliff! My pleasure. If it isn't my favorite rock stars. Hey there. What's up? That gig at Akasuka was beyond cool, you two. We showed them who's boss. You have my support. Do it in style. Definitely. I got drinks for you two, by the way. Thought you'd be too busy to sit down for it, so I brought it with me. See you two rock stars on the ground. Sure thing. Catch you later.
to me. Ah! <laughs> 